the game Guest Guzzlers Extreme for Nintendo Switch. We will see it here on the Switch OLED and this is my experience with it. I know the game was released uh, for uh, PC for example in 2013 but uh, now it has been remastered and it's available for Switch. Uh, the best experience with the game you will have it here on the Switch OLED. I can tell you this because I, I tried the game also on um, on Switch version 2 and also here. This is, it looks uh, five times better anyway. You have the possibility to play uh, various uh, modes. You have power race, uh, you have battle race, knockout and the sponsored event. Let's get this battle race where you can use, um, where you not only are racing uh, uh, using your favorite car, but you will uh, you'll be able to to use all kind of weapons for your vehicles. Uh, you will ask, should I get this? Is it worth it? It looks good, and so on. Well, my experience with this game is this. On, on the Switch version to the game, it looks sometimes uh, too dark. Here on the Switch OLED, the game is absolutely marvelous. Maybe they, uh, uh, they lowered down the graphic to have this smooth experience because, because the game looks fantastic and uh, it's well optimized. Sometimes you will uh, you will, you will see that the game probably has some uh, lower effects and so on. But the experience with this game is fantastic. It's something balanced. Uh, this way you you have to see this this game. Uh, not the best graphic with lag. Not uh, the worst graphic but something in the middle and in this way you will get the perfect experience the fact that you can uh, you can uh, destroy your enemies using various weapons it's very challenging and uh, this is uh, this is you know a real pleasure here to to have this uh, racing and uh, you say uh, it doesn't have multiplayer indeed the game doesn't have multiplayer mode but I don't know what to say related to, to that. Probably in, uh, in one year or something like this, uh, in every game that has multiplayer, you won't find online players to, uh, to continue your adventure. This is happening with a lot of games. And uh, the developers opted for this mode, no multiplayer for you. But this is not a problem anyway. I prefer always the single player mode, a campaign mode, instead of a multiplayer uh, multiplayer mode for, for a game. Sometimes uh, after one year or two years you will appreciate that you have a campaign mode and you can still play the game, you know. Um, back to the game, I can tell you that uh, it's fascinating. I know in 2013 when it was available for PC, you needed a powerful PC to run this. Now the game is available, available, available here, and um, we should appreciate uh, this aspect. I know many of you will say I want 4K, 2K, or something like this, or better graphic on a Switch Pro. Uh, this will happen in the future, but at this moment, I'm highly uh, grateful uh, to be able to play games like this on uh, on the Nintendo Switch anywhere, everywhere, in this portable mode. And definitely this is a game to add to your collection. You'll have a lot of fun with it, at least this is my experience until now. And the game is very challenging. I don't know if you have it or what is your opinion, please share with us by writing the comment and tell us what is your uh, what is your opinion related to this one from my perspective this is a fantastic game and i uh, i like it uh, at the extreme thanks for watching